Oh my gosh. I've been sitting here talking to you guys and I had myself on mute. Hey, Bree. How are you, honey? A long time no see, my love. Yeah, I had myself on mute. I am so sorry, my love. So I actually just beat one of the bosses. I thought that I was recording, but I wasn't. Um, <clears throat> he was like this big blob of a guy. He had big eyeballs on his back. Um, and there was this like human sticking out of his mouth. And you had to shoot at it to kill him. And I just finished that just a few minutes ago. But I thought I was recording. And I wasn't. So here we are. Let me grab something real quick and we'll be ready to go. Dash it all. It is. It's Resident Evil. It's the newest Resident Evil. <laughs> Did you know I had to kind of like... Because I was playing Red Dead. I was playing Red Dead. And that isn't like really scary. You know. So, I mean, there's shooting and stuff but it isn't like scary when I first started playing this about a week or so ago I like had to kind of like toughen myself up it was really freaking me out you can go back and watch some of those playthroughs if you want to and you can hear me screaming and genuinely getting freaked out <laughs> and I'm doing okay my throat's a little bit sore I'm a little bit sleepy so later on I may not talk much but but I still love you All right, let's see. How's your baby doing, honey? How's that baby? Are we getting fat? Babies are known to get fat sometimes, honey. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, hey. You're better off than I thought. Hey, Bobby. Who's that? Oh, come on. We just met a while back, not that it really matters. You're the last asshole in my way, aren't you? You've got fight. I'll <laughs> give you that, Ethan. But what's the plan when you have all four flasks? What are you trying to get at? I could lend you a hand. Not trying to get on my good side? Oh, don't get cocky. I'd kill you if you weren't worth the trouble. There's a stronghold not too far outside the village. Don't Go get there. cocky. You get my flask. Do that, and you pass. First, head back to the graveyard. Self-centered prick. Yes, yes. Okay. Um. Oh, you're on. You're on Red Dead Online. You don't even have. A, oh well. Hopefully they don't catch on to it. Your system just must not be catching on to it. But you said you get money here in about a week, though, don't you? Oh, and your baby's starting to crawl. Oh, honey, I bet he is. Starting to get around, honey. It'll start running around. You'll be chasing it. Is Ew. that a wife? Oh, God. Ooh, it's like that baby. Uh, Bree, earlier in this game, it was like probably a couple videos ago um there was like this baby this baby thing that was and we were stuck underground with it that was like crawling around and stuff and it had a big umbilical cord it was so crazy that's that's the part that i was like screaming at Sure, we don't forget anything. Maybe tomorrow. Maybe, yeah, maybe later on, but maybe tomorrow. I'm really sleepy today. I'm already like pushing through this. I haven't even played this game in two days, and I'm like pushing through it. I'm so sleepy. No one likes me, which is why I thought they would leave me out again.
thought some mother can get her real child back. Ooh. Ooh. This has kind of got a little bit of a Silent Hill vibe to it. A little bit. Which I love. Yes, I had to actually kind of like put it on pause. <laughs> if you've seen the video, like even what I was recording, like it, I had to put it on like pause and sit back in a corner and like get my breath. And we had to like hide underneath a bed. I had to hide underneath a bed and stuff. And it like came in the room and it was crying and oh, it was, it was scary. It really was. That really freaked me out. <clears throat> but no, Bobby, we can, babe. We'll play either later on tonight, but probably tomorrow. I'm just going to be honest with you. I'm already so sleepy. So sleepy. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> Now, I always go back and backtrack because I just don't want to miss anything. Oh, yeah, see, we've been here. Oh, okay. Yes, honey, yes. Yes. See anything? Oh, okay, yeah. This opened up. Hmm. Wonder how we can get to that. Oh, so it's like on multiple levels. Yeah, I just, I wanted to play this. So we can't get back there. Okay. Let's see. Hmm. There's still a lot of this game. Because I went and looked up uh, the boss list to get this guy's name who I had just beat. And um, there's like a couple, a few other bosses even after this. No, I don't have a PC. I sure don't, honey. Jeez. Well, this is the longest elevator ride ever. It's <laughs> crazy. Is that a horse harness? All right, let's see. We'll go save that mechanical door. Maybe we can get out. Oh, 
Oh yeah. Hmm. Oh, that takes this little round ball. I don't think I ever picked that up. Oh yeah. <laughs> what? Mermaid ball. Shit, it went right off. Just like that, honey. That's it. Wait a minute. No, 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 no. Oh, whoa. Back that way. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh huh. did it that was easier than the first one Was 
pick it up. Shut up. <laughs> I got it in the foot. It was me, I did it. <laughs> like what I said, um, I will end up playing this uh, again through uh, standard or more, well, more difficult. Probably through standard. This is casual, easy. I usually do this with horror games uh, so that I can kind of enjoy the story a little bit more in the beginning. What the fuck? Forget my language. Ooh, ooh, oh God. Could you imagine the smell of something like this? I can get up there and get that. I earned those goodies up there, buddy. See, there's a big purse of money up there. It ain't gonna let me get it. That ain't right. Well, hell. So I came up from that way. Look who it is. Whoa. I hear somebody spitting and carrying on. Ah, look at the blood on my gun. Look. On the ass. Oh shit. Whatever that is sounds big. Mother Miranda gave me a mountain. Now, now I can do lots and lots of Kadu experiments. This is my secret special laboratory. I did three Kadu, I'm saying Kadu, Kadu experiments today, but they all went pop and made a mess. I put in the Kadu and then I tried putting wolf blood from a needle into the spine. The person wiggled a lot and then killed my assistant. I could not hold it down, so I put it in a cage. Now I have to feed it. <laughs> Where is it? I can't see anything. 
Oh, fuck. Holy shit, what is it? I killed one of those before, didn't I? Let me get a drink of water. Seems like I killed one of those before. Kill it. It's like big and hairy. Come on, man. If that don't kill it, I don't know what would. Is it dead? Yeah? Yeah? <gasps> awesome. We did it. Crystal beast. Crystal beast. All right. And wait a minute. What is that? Oh, yeah. Alright, so when I go up this way, her way out this. Wait, 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 wait. So, oh. oh almost missed that. Wolf's Bane. Hmm. Ooh, 1700. Dang. That's a lot of, a lot of horsepower there. I can make ammunition for it. Probably not yet. Alright. Um, we'll check up here. Let's see. All these buildings look cleared. You sure there won't be nothing laying around up here? Which there is. Look at that. Herb.
always want to keep saving. Alright, so we'll come out of here, and I think this leads back to town. What was this? Mechanical door. We'll see if we can open it. I haven't been in, I haven't played this for a couple days and then I haven't been in the town much since I first started so I'm a little bit turned around I just want to see what this is what Oh. Oh, okay. Well, we're gonna open it. Whew. Oh, come on. They put the outhouse out with the chickens. Ooh, look at that. Look. Pigeon blood ruby. Got that combined, and we got to find that doll's head too. See, look, man, look at all those pet crates everywhere. That is weird. Oh, hey, was it your name, Jake or Cody or something like that? <laughs> it 
yeah, we talk on Instagram, Arkansas. Hey. Uh, just playing Resident Evil, honey. Hold on just a second, guys. I'm going to hit this real quick. Hold on. Lake. Okay, yes. That's what, okay. Awesome. Okay, I will will remember next time, honey. I will. Blake, you got to forgive me. A lot of my fish have died, honey, and I've been quite distraught. But hold on, hold on just a second, guys. I'm right here, but just hold on. Yeah, it's been really hard. They, It's all been like swim bladder disease and something else. They're all, they've all got something. With the exception of my fish in the other tank, they're perfectly fine. It's the ones in my biggest tank have something. Uh, the day before yesterday, I did like a double water change where I took the water down to like 20% filled it all the way up to like 70% and then took another like 50% back out, like sucking um, all the excess stuff that had came out of my filter. I also kind of cleaned out my filters and the tank definitely looks a lot better. And I also got some medicine, some stress coat, aquarium salt, which can help them rebuild their slime coats, help them ward off any infections. So it's all I can do. It hurts, though. It bothers me. Oh, that's right. That means I got it. Okay. Um, brr. I can't believe I did that. I should have known. Spooky ass. There's got to be something in here for the building to still be red. Look, it's like a bunch of eyeballs. Good night. You have a good night. I hope you have a good day tomorrow. And thank you. Thank you so much, honey. 
Yeah, Bobby, Arkansas will play with you. I will in a couple days. I'm just really into this. Um, see what I mean? Like, there's, there's something here. Oh, okay. Okay. Yep, if I'm on, you guys will see me. You'll see me get on if I get on tomorrow. Meanness. I want to know what's in that building. Alright, let's see if we need to do anything else. We need to go shoot those chickens. Ooh, we need to try to get to that. Ah, oh, <laughs> my apologies. Do you have enough firepower? I can now offer an expanded weapon modification service. This is Lord Moreau's? I suppose it's what they call the beauty of the grotesque. Crystallized human remains. Now to spend like kings. <laughs> yes. Dang, dude, I have $93,000. Do you have enough firepower? I can now offer an expanded weapon modification service. Well, we'll see. Dang, dude. Wait, wait. Oh, look at that. 1700? Jeez. I like this one. <laughs> One moment, please. That grenade launcher, I was going to say if it would have let me... Um, I was gonna have to make it like its reload thing was too slow. Ah, 
It's fine. All finished. About it. Securing goods is more important than anything. Anything, my friend. Anything, my friend. Ha ha ha. Carry on. Thank you. Food is life. Yep, that's about it. It's sure to be a good meal. Creepy. All righty, let's see. There's going to be some places we can get into. We'll see again if we can unlock that. We may not be able to, but we'll try. <laughs> wow. I'm sure she is. Oh my god! <gasps> oh god! Hell. Um, I just want to make sure real quick, can I get this? What is this? Should I kill him? Look at it, look at me.
I understand that, but you gotta understand that I'm playing something, you know, that I'm wanting to play. I'm just not into Red Dead right now. Like, I'm really, really digging this Resident Evil right now. I never got that thing. See? Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah. He said he was... Yeah, he's offline. There's nobody else here, I don't think. And he was saying that he was getting offline, so I thought you were talking to me. Let's see. Yeah, I don't have it yet. We're just gonna have to go. Oh, well. Yeah, we'll just have to go. We're gonna be going. Oh, that's right, we gotta put something in that too. Uh, just recently, um, we were given these gingerbread cookies, <laughs> and that sounds so good, but it actually had, like, dehydrated bits of ginger in the cookies, and that sounds like it would be really good. I thought it would, I love dried fruit. I thought it sounded so good. Honey, it was disgusting. Like, it tasted like what you would think that rotting animal flesh would taste like. It was dis uh, disgusting. Just terrible. That's just the most recent thing. But I can't really think of anything else. I know I've tasted other bad taste and stuff before. Save it.
this game, what, about a week or a week and a half? I think I've been playing it. About a week and a half. That's, I bet you anything that's a big boss battle. Uh, well, let's do it. Why not? Oh, I'm past that lady. Yeah, she's the first boss. And in fact, I just beat the second one. Just a little bit ago. The lady, like, she was awesome, man. That castle and stuff was amazing. Yeah. Oh, yes. Let's go back here. Come on. <sighs> Ooh, a ladder. That's a that's a sudden twist. <gasps> What's the name of it? What's the name of that game? It's locked from the other side. Yeah. Well, huh.
it did nothing. Nothing at all. Was it supposed to? Oh gosh, yes. Oh god. It was terrible. Like, I think that they need to start paying attention that, like, we're all different. We don't all learn at the same pace. We also, we also have different interests, even as kids, for a reason. I think that we're all born with these things inside of us, like, that you'll see as a kid being displayed through people, why they're children things that they would be really good at with a passion when they get older like mine de mine definitely was animals and like i was really into paleontology archaeology um things like that but i wasn't good at math but i was good at memorizing things about animals and stuff and the certain math that would have went along with like measuring bones and stuff like that would have came, that would have came with paleontology i would have been into like and i do understand that you know but like algebra and this really deep math i i don't i it's i didn't understand it before and i don't think i'd understand it now like i understand math to the extent i can survive yeah. you know and i certainly be able to do a job that i really like but yeah. I don't know. There was other things, too, like learning. It was like every year we were learning about the American presidents. You know, why didn't they teach us more about, like, European history in American schools? Like, why didn't they teach me more about, you know, the real princes and princesses that lived in castles? And I don't know. Like, there's just so much more that they could have taught us that, you know, would have, I don't know. Yeah, school's weird. It is. And I didn't like it when I was a kid. And I got sick all the time, too. Let me see. Wait a minute. So this is the only ones that we can use. But I bet I could jump on that. Hmm. Yeah, it was like, when I would get sick, I got sick constantly as a kid. Up until I was like 15 or 16, I was all the time sick. And I would miss so much school. Like, sometimes I would miss 20 days. I was so freaking sick. By the time I would come back, I would have so much homework. Um, and I had disconnected from the other kids. You know, I, I just, it was terrible. Yeah, there was times when it was just really bad. There's times when I miss it, you know. 
Oh yeah. Mm, we got it, honey. Look at the us. Uh, look at this fancy sauce. I know. Yeah, I haven't either. Which I don't now. Ever since, I'd say ever since I was 18 and up, maybe 19 and up, my health has been so much better. Like, I don't get sick much. Not real sick. Like, I'll kind of get a scratchy, kind of little bit sore throat like I do right now. I think it's the way I slept last night. Um, I had my air on all night, my air conditioner. So that's probably why, but other than that, I really don't, I don't get bronchitis anymore or the flu or really bad colds. Not much. Once every couple years, once every two or three years, I might. But that's it, man. You may get like that too as you get older. What's this? Oh, yeah. We did it. We can go sell it. When I was, uh, I'd say like age 13 and under, yeah. Yeah, I was made fun of for being fat. <laughs> and then it, people kind of made fun of me a little bit because I like dogs so much and I drew all the time. I get made fun of for drawing of, of all things. How dare I? But when I hit about 14, when I, when I was coming back, going, uh, like coming back from summer vacation, going into eighth grade, um, and I turned 14 that September, um, I got with my first boyfriend. We ended up being together until I was almost 18, 19 years. Well, I was almost 19. And, um, that kind of like heightened my popularity a little bit, even though he's from another school. And I changed too. I started getting real pretty. I started getting really pretty, and people started changing to me, which is, uh, people started changing in their treatment towards me, which is ridiculous. That's terrible. It is. That's so terrible. Like, I was the same person. Uh... Oh, oh, shit. Look at, oh, God. All right, that's good. We'll go down here first. Oh, oh, look at that. Not really that much, but it looked nice. <laughs> oh, this looks so real. Look at this. Look. Oh, it's crazy. Man, next time I am definitely playing it on more higher difficulty. <laughs> I 
Breathing heavy like a pervert. Yes. Yep, I glowed up. They might. It might be uh, available on VR. Man, I'll tell you, yeah, I glue, I glowed up in high school, but I really started looking good, like, in my mid and late 20s. That's when a lot of us, I noticed, even other people I went to school with and known when I was younger, started glowing up, was uh, actually in our 20s. But, yeah, some people peak in high school. They'll, like, glow up in high school, look really pretty, really good looking, and then... In their 20s and 30s, they look like absolute shit. Like, you can see some... You can go to my Instagram and see me and stuff. I've done good good for myself, man. For being 37, I still look young, too. You just gotta take care of yourself. But even when you... Even when you don't look as pretty, it's okay. Like... Like right now, I look like shit. My hair is all pulled back. Dude, they keep coming. What is going on? How do I get this lit? It ain't even giving me a chance. Wow. Hmm. Oh, I wonder if I can set it on fire with... Oh, oh hey, come here. Come here. That's right. Come on. Oh, look at this. Come here, buddy. Buddy. Come here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> that was creative. Yeah, yeah, that's us. But man, I'm telling you, you'll um you'll start looking better and like you're if you're a guy, you told me you were a guy, if you really are, cuz you know some people lie. I'm not saying that you did lie, but you know some people online lie. But a lot of men, I'm telling you, honey, actually most men, I go as far as saying like 70-80% of men start looking better in their 20s, their 30s, even their 40s. Like Guys typically look better with age. Even a like totally geeky looking guy at 18 years old looks so much better when he's 30, 35, 40. It's it's crazy. It's the weirdest thing. Like men get so good looking the older they get. All of them. Like, Raj's, Raj looks so much better now at 32 than he did when he was 18, than when he was 22, you know? Like, this whole thing that, you know, we're all be our most beautiful in our teens is such a fucking lie. I'm serious, it is, and you're going to see, it is. Yeah, maybe back in the old days, in the medieval days, when... People didn't live past the age of 40. Dying from the clap and the plague. Nowadays, we're taking such better care of ourselves. Like, look at me right now. I'm just playing video games. I'm not stressing. I'm not worried. I'm just chilling. And I don't have to hoe a garden or nothing. So that's why. That's why... Back then, people probably did start aging much quicker than we do now. Yeah, the facial hair starts coming in real good. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, there's some guys can't grow a good beard or nothing until they're up in their late 20s. Um, 
and then men they, they kind of thicken up too is the thing like speaking as a woman they kind of thicken up men do like in their just even in their face like their jaw structure they get more muscle a little bit more meat even fat you know around their face and stuff and it's nice it's gorgeous it's handsome I think that's it down here Oh. Yeah, some women don't, but have you noticed it's been trendy now, though, the last, like, gosh, five or six years, like, no shave November and stuff. And a lot of women, like, on my TikTok and stuff, a lot of the videos I come across is women saying stuff about kind of, like, chubby men with beards, with facial hair. But not even just chubby, like, men with facial hair, period. Like the, not just a must, mustache though, like if you ever go to do your facial hair someday, whenever it finally comes in real good, um, don't just do a mustache though, because that's creepy for some reason. Like when men just have a mustache, that's creepy. <laughs> do like the goatee type thing, the beard. All right, let's get out of here. Let's see. I'm glad we came up this way. I got a lot of treasure. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Not just a mustache by itself. That's kind of creepy a little bit. I'm just being honest. I don't, I don't know what it is. But it's creepy. Oh, that's where I just came from. See, I'm a nut. Don't listen to me, I'm a nut. I'm gonna play for about 30 more minutes and I'm gonna get off here and cook me and my mom something to eat. I'm sure she's hungry. We're gonna make Pizza, vegetarian, homemade, even the crust, honey. Even the crust is homemade pizza. I do crispy, thin, homemade crust. I have it down to a science, honey. You have no idea. Most people brag, but they're just bullshit and they don't know anything. I know everything. Oh, yeah, she's going to be happy. I make it just a little bit spicy. Oh, it's so good. It is, honey. I, I'm telling you you would die. Do you like regular crust, like thick crust or deep dish or thin? I like thin. But sometimes stuffed crust pizza is really good. I need to learn how to make that. <gasps> Bitch. Bitch. What's that? What's that? Ooh. Man, I'm gonna have to go get rid of that meat and like put, I'm gonna put that gun up. So I ain't gonna be using it anymore. Uh, ooh, ooh, oh, ah,
Yeah, see, I don't really want those. The network of consciousnesses. When you take the Baker incident into account, the host of the mm -hmm, are part of a network of consciousness. Network is linked to hear them. We could assume the organism here is data storage. If that's the case, then what data is Miranda after? Hmm. Mm mm mm. Funky chickens. Hold on just a second. Dude, my dad is the like biggest asshole, I swear. He like leaves uh, the refrigerator and freezer door open. And then if I just say, hey dad, the freezer door was open, he gets immediately very shitty. Um, and it's like, I'm just saying you need to watch it because if, if it's, I'm not saying he obviously meant to do it, but like if he accidentally, you know, it pops open when you shut it or something. We just got to pay attention, make sure it shuts, because obviously it could spoil all the food. He's just, my dad's like one of the most difficult people on the planet to communicate with. He wants to fight and argue. Oh, you like hand tossed. I am definitely, definitely the cook in this house. Definitely. They can cook. Um, like my dad's idea of cooking, though, is um, boiling stuff. But mine, 
<laughs> extends past that. Oh my god! See, I don't want these fucking flash bangs. to get back to where I can sell some of this stuff. Um, no, no, I'm back in my bedroom. He didn't hear me. I didn't say anything. I just said, we just want to be careful. <laughs> you know, sometimes some fridges, and ours, I think, does do it. Like when you shut it, like a, the other door, like if you shut the refrigerator door, the freezer door will pop open a little bit. And so you just got to make sure that you push both of them shut, is all I was trying to say to him. But he was... He got mad at me over that, so yeah. He gets mad no ah, matter what I say. Yes, yes. I can hardly wait. Just excuse me a moment. Here it is. Please, join me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't mind having that again. Hmm. Ah! Don't let up yet. Securing goods is more important than anything. Anything, my friend. Oh man, 50,000. Gunsmithy. That is right. Did I have somewhere that I could keep guns? Like I could put extra guns. Pay me no mind. I look forward to seeing the fruits. It seemed like there was. In the very beginning. Exploration as you wish. I 
I think I can sell this. Because I've got so many other guns that are stronger, like this one. Life. Food is life. Ah, thank, thank you. you. There we go. I'm skilled in all, all sorts right. of weapons modifications, and will do them for a small fee. Mm-hmm. These hands are more dexterous than one might think. Mm -hmm. Um, no, I don't, I don't know about that. I don't know if there's, there might be machine, like machine guns. There might be later on. We might get one. One moment, uh, please. Yep. Okay. All right. Please come again. All right, I'll probably go on and get off of here right now. I know it's crazy, I, I'm, but I'm I'm starting to get hungry. I'm really starting to get hungry. So I'm going to go on and get off here, but later on I might play, but if not tomorrow. So thank you for watching. I hope you guys have a good night. I'm just getting so hungry, and I know Mom's probably getting hungry too. But you guys have a good night, and I'll see you soon. Bye.